welcome back to my channel for another video this video is so random because it's taco tuesday and i normally don't film on tuesdays but it's taco tuesday and if you know me then you know your girl loves tacos and y'all see my nail i've been trying to get these damn nails off this shit hurt but anyway that's a whole nother story so i'm like i can make a little quick little video for y'all you know some little um, i don't know i want some cheesy chicken like pull tacos i keep seeing all these little videos on like these cheesy pull apart tacos on tiktok and all that look i'm gonna go make some so if you want to see how i make them stay tuned i'm gonna get my ass up and go in the kitchen and make some tacos so if you're new here my name is bianca i hope that you stay and subscribe after today if you like what you see i hope that you stay mm-hmm share like comment helps us out all that good stuff and i'll see y'all in the kitchen all right y'all so we in the kitchen i'm gonna show y'all my ingredients and let's get started so y'all we go, like i said we're gonna make this easy quick i got this rotisserie chicken y'all this meal this is crazy i got this rotisserie chicken yesterday and i was gonna do something with it but i'm gonna use this so let's get started y'all also have some tortillas I got green pepper, red pepper, onion, some cheese. Let's just make it happen, okay? Let's make it happen. I forgot to show y'all. So I also have these, which is basically Rotel, but store, but store brand. Same thing, okay? Don't sleep on the store brand, okay? It's just cheaper. Listen, act like you know. <laughs> okay, y'all, so basically, I am going to shred this chicken into this bowl. So that is what I'm going to do now. Just gonna pretty much take it apart. Add all of my pieces without the bone in this bowl. Don't forget the skin. That's the good part, okay? So, that's just what I'm doing here. Taking all of this chicken apart, taking it off the bone, placing it in the bowl so that I can shred it, and I'll be back. Okay, y'all, so now that I have my chicken in this bowl, I'm going to get two forks, and I am going to shred my chicken. Two forks. That's all you need. You just want to... Pull your chicken apart. Shred it nice and easy. Comes apart really easily. Does not take a lot of work. And that's why you like to have these. These rotisserie chickens come in handy, baby. Okay. Who the hell wanna be? Okay. So I ain't gonna lie to y'all. Y'all see me on here. Everything ain't from scratch. I'm not finna lie to y'all. This ain't no tutorial. Okay. Do it how you wanna do it. You feeling like doing all that. But if you want to do it from scratch, you can. Typically, I probably would have, but shit. <laughs> I had some chicken in there that I ain't touching. I said, oh, you know what? I can make them little pull-apart chickens, chicken tacos. With that chicken I got in that goddamn refrigerator. You know, use what you got to get what you want. You better. Y'all know that song? If you don't know that song, you too young. <laughs> but that's what I'm doing right here, yo. Just shred my chicken. And I'm going to show y'all when I'm done. I'll be back. Now that I have shredded up my chicken, I am now going to cut my peppers and onions. So... Let's rinse these off. Definitely want to rinse them off, okay? You want to wash your veggies. Don't know who's been touching them. If they done fell on the floor, somebody put it back. You know, you don't know what that is. So that's what you want to do. So I'm going to slice these long way because, look, that's what I'm going to do. Okay? Just pay attention. So I'm going to slice these. Like that. I'm going to show y'all. Come close. So as y'all can see, I am slicing them the long way. 
That's what I'm going to do to my onion. That's what I'm going to do to my green pepper. So, happy bake. Okay, guys, so these are all the seasonings I am using. I'm not using much. I'm just using this taco chicken season, garlic powder, onion powder, adobo, pepper. Okay, that's it. This nail shit is so funny, y'all. Look at this shit. Like, hell no. Somebody can't show me my nails back. <laughs> no, I need a break. These shits hurt. All right, bye. I'll be back. Okay, guys, so I just added my veggies in there. I'm just going to let these sweat a bit. And then I'm gonna add my chicken and we'll go from there. All right, y'all, so I'm just cooking my veggies down, letting them sweat a bit. And then I'm gonna add my chicken. I'm gonna season it. And then I'm gonna add my other ingredients. But y'all see that in a moment. All right, y'all, so now that my veggies have did what they need to do, add in my chicken. Okay, so I'm going to add that chicken taco seasoning. Yes, we adding the whole pack, okay? The whole pack. Then we're going to add some adobo seasoning. Then we're gonna add some onion powder and some garlic powder and some pepper. And I'll be back, cause I'm holding the phone, I'll be back. Hey y'all, so now that I have added my spices and my seasonings, I am going to add those uh, diced tomatoes with the green peppers and them basically, AKA the bootleg roach out. Same thing, okay. Don't be a, don't be all bougie up in the market. I ain't getting that because that's not real. Yes, it is. Look on the label. If the label say compare to, baby, it's the same thing. Even if it don't say that, if you know what you're doing, if you know, you know. That's the if you know, you know situation. Okay, we just gonna keep it all the way real. So I'm just gonna let that mix together. I'm gonna bring y'all close so y'all can see it. Y'all see that? Mm-hmm, baby. That chicken, those peppers, tomatoes. Watch when we add that cheese. Melted on that tortilla. Mm-hmm. Happy bake. Okay, guys. So while that is cooking, simmering down, I am going to make some homemade guacamole. I already have my ingredients chopped up. I want to bring y'all closer so y'all can see what I got going on here. So I got tomatoes chopped up, red onion, cilantro, jalapeno, and I'm about to get started on my avocados and my limes. So let me bring y'all closer. Okay, y'all, so here are my ingredients. I am aware that the last little clip, y'all really couldn't see my, my head, but that's neither here nor there. Y'all saw what y'all need to see. So I'm going to bring y'all around so y'all can watch me do the... Guacamole, shit. <laughs> I'll be back. All right, y'all, so I'm going to get better with my angles. All right, y'all, so we're going to start the frying process. Y'all, he is sizzling. Okay. Now, we're going to add our meat and our little pepper mixture yeah you see that i'm gonna make sure these things is nice and packed baby and then we're going to add our cheese y'all holding this phone and trying to do this at the same time it's crazy y'all be gonna make me burn my shit like but i love y'all so add the cheese i'll be back i'll be back y'all i'll be back all right y'all see me but I'm trying to do two things at once. All right, I'm going to flip it. Wow. Just like that. See that? Nice and golden. All right, I'll be big. Okay, guys. So here is my final product. It looks so good. 
I got this little bowl from Ross. It is so cute. Let's guac and roll. That's so cute. And the guac is so good. As you can see, I've already cracked open a bag of chips to go with it. I have my pico. I have sour cream. And I have my tacos. And, of course, I had me a red cup. But, yo, it was so good. Oh, my goodness. So, this is what it came out looking like. I'm going to show you all the pull. And, yeah. That's it. That's all. Love y'all. But I don't want to play your face. Makes me look at you too out there Baby, you can give us something Baby, I can run all the time Okay guys, so that is it for this video on these shredded chicken cheesy pull apart tacos Y'all these tacos were so good. They just remind me of like making a quesadilla. So to me, it's pretty much the same thing However, these were so good. They satisfied my craving. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye y'all. Love y'all